All right, we're going to be doing a full review on the product that I'm going to be showing you. Uh, you can see on the label, this is a HobbyMate product. Um, this is actually their new F3 flight controller. And some of you guys didn't know about HobbyMate. They also are the same company, Target Hobby, and they've got an Amazon store. But some of you guys may know HobbyMate because of these right here. And, um, and uh, this is the, the Q100. Um, this is a micro quad copter kit. So I'm digging through all this stuff for a reason. Let me pull this out. I'm going to open this up. This is their, their kit. For this quad. This is the flight controller that it comes with. Um, guys have been loading both clean flight and uh, base uh, beta flight on it and it runs on the alien software and uh, I got this in the mail and this is a one cell only so this is this one. I'm gonna set this off to the side because what Hobby Made is now offering is this F3 controller and they're working on just coming out with it. This is brand new. So let's see here. It says, good luck. Uh, you got a $20 credit at HobbyMate. Register your account on HobbyMate.com and hold the luck with you. If you don't have a registered account and you go ahead and register with them, they'll give you $20 in coupons for free. But let's just go ahead and open this flight controller really quick. It, uh, it comes with, <clears throat> if you can see that, four plugs. Those are for the motors so that you can use the, the little motors like the Tiny Whoop does if that's what you want to use for your uh, eight millimeter motors. It comes with this battery lead for soldering. Um, a little sticky pad, which is, this comes with that as well. And then this is the board. Now, I think this is the future it's got an F3 um, processor on it, but look at the size difference for you guys that want to do like super micro builds. Look at the size. That is, that is a tiny board. The offsets on the, the little holes for mounting the board are exactly the same, but that board is super tiny and this actually comes two cell ready to go right here two cell lipo by default and then you can also use one cell but you've got to change these there's like a short on the solder pad on this thing somewhere that you can either short it out as a two cell or short it out as a one cell I'd have to look at the documentation again to see it but I'm gonna be doing a review on this I'm actually gonna build this kit out using this flight controller instead of the Alienware flight controller that it originally comes with. We're going to use this one and we're actually going to run 2Cell and uh, see what that experience is like. So there you go, that's the unboxing.